I have the pleasure of being with Tamara Rojo, who is the artistic director of the English National Ballet. And I'm here to talk to Tamara about what she has on her wrist. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I was approached by Bax and Strauss um, and they wanted me to be the face of the Victoria Collection. Ballet dancers, especially principal ballet dancers, we are generally real perfectionist. Um, and what is clear um, about Bax and Strauss is that they're equally demanding with uh, with their jewelry and with their watches and and that you know it's all in the detail it's all in the small things and and if everything is cared for and finished to the highest quality um, then the whole product whether it's a ballet or a watch is of the highest standard and if this watch were a ballet which ballet do you think it would be well because it's the snowdrop and it's so beautifully white i will say it's uh, swan lake act two <laughs> Act two? Yes, the so white swan. <laughs> an absolute classic then. An absolute classic, yeah. I think what, what I really loved about this collection is that they've managed to combine um, the classicism uh, and the traditions, but also they're kind of very creative and modern with it. And I guess that's, that's the balance that any classical art form has to find, is how to preserve what's best of the past, but keep absorbing what's best of the present and actually be aware of what's coming in the future. So all those things that um, every artistic organization, and I think um, jewelry and watchmaking is certainly an art form, um, needs to balance those things. And I believe Bax and Strauss does it beautifully. If you want to know all that's happening in the world of jewelry and watches, visit my website, thejewelryeditor.com. <laughs>